वेलकम गाइस टू येट एन अदर एक्सपेरिमेंट बेस्ड वीडियो ऑफ आयो हाथ here i teach you simple science experiments with the help of things which you can easily find at home in this video you are going to see what are the various solid components of garden soil to begin with this activity you have to take soil sample from your garden like i am taking soil sample from the base of this huge banyan tree of my garden For the collection of soil sample you have to dig out some soil with the help of trowel and collect it in a container we shall take this soil sample indoors for subsequent steps So guys we have collected this soil sample from my garden so let's start with the activity to perform this activity what all you need let me tell you that also we need a straight sided glass jar with a lid we need a glass one scoop and water now let's start with the procedure step 1 take this straight sided glass jar which has a lid step 2 Fill this jar one third with the soil sample. You can see I have filled this glass jar one third with the soil sample. Step three: Fill this jar with clear water up to the top. See I have filled water in this jar almost up to the top. Step 4 tighten the lid of this glass jar and shake it vigorously to make uniform slurry of this soil sample. See now it's a uniform slurry. Step number 5 is the last step of this activity and in this step you have to keep this glass jar undisturbed for at least 12 hours or overnight so i am leaving it as such undisturbed see you after 12 hours welcome back guys almost 12 hours have passed let's have a look at the glass jar Here you can see the soil has settled down completely and in fact distinct layers of different components of soil they are also visible very clearly to know about these let's have a closer look at the glass jar this soil sample is a heterogeneous mixture of five types of solid components here Soil components have settled down as per their size and weight. The topmost solid component that you see in this jar is humus. Being lightest amongst the components, it is floating on the surface of water. It is brownish black in color and composed of dead and decaying organic matter. Slightly heavier than the humus and the second component of soil is clay it is yellowish brown in color and made up of very fine soil particles it helps in holding water beneath clay you can see a clear layer of brown colored soil particles this component of soil is silt it is composed of minerals Fourth solid component of this soil sample is sand, heavier than silt. You can see it is granular in appearance and helps in draining out of excess of water from the soil. Heaviest among all these is the bottom layer of soil particles, which is made up of gravel. Gravel is a loose aggregation of small rock fragments. 
it further enhances seepage of water and prevents rotting of roots here i also want to mention that the composition of these solid components of soil may vary from place to place the composition of soil sample of my garden may well be different from yours so friends with this we are through with the activity i'm sure you must have liked it and now it's time for you to go out and explore the solid components of soil sample of your garden